tonight, still a lot of questions after a delivery driver shot and killed a dog belonging to actor Angie Harmon. This happened outside her Charlotte home. Harmon says an Instacart delivery driver is to blame, and she says the person who showed up with her delivery was not the same person Instacart's app said would be the driver. Many are wondering if these drivers can arm themselves. WCNC Charlotte's Megan Bragg is looking into not only Instacart's policies, but other popular delivery services in this Verify Fact Check. Well, these are the policies that we went to Instacart, Uber Eats, DoorDash and Grubhub. We went to each of their policies to get answers. So let's take a look at our first question. Can anyone else use a specific driver's account to make a delivery? Well, this is going to be a no for Instacart and for Uber Eats. They have very similar policies. They do not allow drivers to share accounts and drivers can actually be suspended if they allow others to drive for them. Now, both companies say if you notice someone else is driving and it's not the person that the app says it should be, you should report them right away. Meanwhile, we are putting DoorDash and Grubhub underneath this needs context tab. And here's why. Under DoorDash's policy, they say, quote, as an independent contractor, contractor, you are free to choose the method by which you perform the delivery. It is entirely up to you to complete the delivery service yourself or to delegate the tasks to your employee or subcontractor. However, a subcontractor must also have a valid DoorDash account as well. Now, Grubhub states you will not license, sell or and or otherwise provide access to and or use of your account or the driver app to any third party other than subcontractors. Now that's pursuant to your partner agreement. Another question that people are asking is whether drivers are allowed to carry a gun while making delivery. So let's take a look at this one. Instacart and Uber Eats prohibit drivers and guests from carrying a firearm while using the app unless local laws allow otherwise. Now we could not find a written policy for firearms for Grubhub or DoorDash on their website. And we did reach out to both companies and ask what their policy is and whether their drivers are allowed to pack heat on the job. And of course, once we do find out those answers, we'll be sure to update this story. With Verify Fact Check, I'm Megan Bragg.